between last week when we were poo-pooing Cooper as somebody to sit. And, uh, and sure enough, he came out and he had a great game. I'm not ready to give him the benefit of the doubt against Darrell Rivas, and I think it's an easy call for the Jets to just tell Darrell Rivas, spend a week watching film on this guy, get to know him, and teach this rookie a lesson. Mm -hmm. And I think that it's going to be a tough call going with Amari Cooper. It's anything more than a middle-of-the-pack number two wide receiver. Two things I think you got to be concerned about when you're talking about guys going against tough matchups, and it happened last week. Wide receiver screens are uh, a great tool for any quarterback to use. Cooper scored on a wide receiver screen. You know, so his, his offensive line got out, they made a great play, he was able to score. His other big catch came on almost essentially a jump ball, you know, where it, it, Brett got lost, he thought he had safety help. Um, so I, I think you got to look at it and say the Jets secondary won't make those mistakes. They're better tackling than the Chargers are as a whole. Uh, Eric Wells didn't play in that game, so take that into consideration too. So I, I think just the secondary is better. Cooper will struggle. It's very difficult to bench him. Um, but you just have to sort of compare him to some of the other guys. Like, I'd start Stephon Diggs over him without question. I think if you had the stones to sit him last week, you can sit him again this week, especially if you started somebody in place of him who ended up being okay for you, maybe somebody like Diggs. Yeah, also depends on who you have, but Rashard Matthews or Amari Cooper, just for comparison's sake. I would start Rashard Matthews. Me too. Lamar Miller at New England. 11.2 is the projection for him. He's one of a few running backs to hit double digits this week, according to Sportsline. Do you buying or selling that? Time? I think that's a really good projection. I think that's real close to the number. I'm going to say just under, and I think it's going to be right around 10, maybe 11. I think he can get you that many fantasy points. And I think the floor isn't too far off of that either. I think it's around 80, 90 total yards. We've seen.